this is, uh, I've worked with some people that have been carpentering for a long time, and once you get past this mark here, they really don't know what it is. Uh, obviously, that's your half, so you've got 12 inches and a half, thus three quarters, that's one quarter. In here, you have three eighths, five eighths, seven eighths, or one eighth, and then in here is sixteenths. And on certain portions of the tape, you'll look, they'll actually be marked in 30 seconds. Now, anybody that does framing to a 30 second of an inch, they're some kind of carpenter. <laughs> yeah. Usually you don't use anything less than 16 of an inch. So, for example, though, you need to be able to know that 5 16 is a quarter plus 1 16. So, you find a quarter very quickly, so 5 16 you put your mark right there. As opposed to having to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5... Because then when you get up here and you want to know where, say for example, 13 sixteenths is, which is the one right after three quarters, you don't want to have to start counting all the way from the bottom and try, oh, wait a minute, did I count that right? So you learn your, learn your fractions, that it goes eighths, you know, every second mark is an eighth of an inch, every fourth mark is a quarter of an inch, and then sixteenths, and uh, learning how those go. So I, I'm going to spend a lot of time on that, but that's important to know and be able to pick something up quickly. So if somebody says, cut me board 12 and 9 sixteenths, I know it's right there in that mark. If they say, you know, cut me 12 and 3 eighths, well, I know it's right there in that mark. So being able to communicate and translate that very quickly to what you're seeing on your tape is very, very important.